because in Texas yesterday we were wearing toboggans and hats and today we're barefoot with shorts and short sleeve shirts because we're Texas right why not why not be a little weird huh Wayland oh, so sorry I haven't recorded all day guys I am once again exhausted per usual that's my usual go thing yummy eat your banana so I uh, right now guys Lord and mercy! Today is a warm day, so sorry I had to change real quick. I'm headed up to HEB. I'm gonna go get order Ginger's cake before I go pick her up from school. And that's pretty much what I got going on today. So sorry I haven't vlogged. Sorry I look like heck. Um, I'm just, you know. This is me, like, I don't even know why I'm apologizing, really, because... I don't know why I'm even apologizing, because honestly, this is me. I mean, this is how I look. Y'all are gonna have to get used to that. I look pretty ratchet on a daily. <laughs> is that good cake? Cake. So I'm about to go pick Ginger up. Just got done picking out her cake. They did not have basketball cake, so we just kind of made one on our own. Um, I'm gonna give these a go. I'll let y'all know how they taste. Uh, but I'm gonna get off here because there's, of course, like three people yeah. walked up to their cars that are right next yeah. to me. To be honest with you guys, these things are nothing to write home about. I thought they'd be so good. The circle of life. Isn't that what the little girl in the circle did? She just kept drawing circles, but it was they were all black. The movie The Circle? Was that a little boy? It was a little boy, and he's in the beginning of the movie, and he's in the class, and he's drawing circles. And he just keeps drawing circles, just like, let me show. Gladiator. <laughs> you want it to look like a donut on the inside, like Ginger said, and all these little straggly sides on the outside. After you fill it in, that's what you're going to overlay it and make it like a big old donut. Okay, so, so far we've only put refried beans and a little bit of Mexican corn sprinkled around with a little bit of sugar sprinkled around because we love sugar in our spicy things just to kind of equal out the heartburn. Um, next, we're going to put some tomatoes. And just kind of do the same thing. You just get a spoonful of stuff and sprinkle it around. Whatever you want to put in here. Sorry about my phone cord being all up in the way. It's the only way I can have it charging because it's dying. But anything you want to put in, you put in. Whatever you like. Whatever you like on your taco. If you want onions in here, which I would prefer onions in here. But my kids don't like onions, so. Anyways, there you go. Now we're going to put the taco meat in. Flap these things over and pop this baby in the oven after we put some cheese on it. I don't really know how this one's gonna turn out guys 
I really overstuffed it, but I was just not wanting to waste anything. So, time to clean up and chop up. Get back with you guys in a minute. You know, I've always loved to cook, but I would have to say that my least favorite part about cooking would be the cleanup. And I'm sure all of you could agree with me there. Is up with me getting stuff that is bad. Look at this. Ew. That's gross. Y'all think the outside's still okay? Ugh. So I got the uh, Shiner Bach H-E-B brand um, Shiracho beans. And oh my gosh, they are so good. And you can actually taste the Shiner Bach in it. It is very good. Del I swear I am not a... Um, paid spokesman for H-E-B, but you'll probably hear me talk about H-E-B a lot because I love that place. Anyways, <clears throat> still waiting on dinner. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Good job. Good job. 